Okay, tell me a little bit about yourself and what do you like to do in free time? Play video games. What kind of video games do you like to play? Sports. Yes. I like to be like the managerial, take care of different areas, administration in basketball. And basketball is just something I always enjoy. MDA camp is definitely the best week of my entire year. It's one week in the month of June and all of the kids ages 6 to 17 who have muscular dystrophy get to go to camp and I love it. Summer camp's great. I mean, they have a bunch of activities and things that we wouldn't normally be able to do when we're at our normal houses. And you come here uh, one week out of the summer and you see all your friends and they're similar to you, they have the same problems and then you get together, you know each other and it's just a very fun time. MDA doing all they can, you almost get an assurance at this point that there is going to be a cure. There, there's, there's going to be something to slow this process down to buy us more time to find that cure. And right now that's what we're looking for. Well, MDA's done a lot. They, they helped my family through a difficult time. They didn't know what to do, what the future was going to hold. Was I going to need handicapped accessible equipment? Was I need, they helped me set up with the first lift I read. Think back to when you were first diagnosed. Can you tell me a little bit about that time? I was at my grams when she used to babysit me and about three of my other cousins and I won't be able to keep up with them and she told my parents and also when it was about time for me to start to be able to go up the steps in our house I couldn't really go up the steps I have to crawl up the steps. Naturally we came home and checked on the computer and read things on the computer and naturally what we seen we did not like and denial first you know this can't be it can't be our son and of course in the long run it came to fruition lots of things that happened that were not expected you know i'm still here i'm grateful for that if i never would have found i was wrong i could be in a much different situation and I, I may not even made it past being an adolescent. I have mitochondrial myopathy. It's where my mitochondrians don't do what they should do and I can only walk short distances and I have kind of limited strength in my arms. Slowly his muscles deteriorate because he's missing dystrophin which is like a glue that holds the muscles together and he's going to be going into his wheelchair shortly, which is one of the first things that happens with Duchenne's muscular dystrophy. He gets weak and is unable to hold himself up, so being in a wheelchair makes it more easy for him to get around and be with his buddies. I can't move my arms or my fingers are stuck at certain angles and my elbows no longer go out straight. I'm more like I'd say maybe like 95, maybe 100 degrees. My knees don't go past, like I say, 120 degrees. We have slowed down. We take life a lot slower. Yeah. Um, we do different things. Instead of playing baseball or basketball, we do other, other activities instead. He has his uh, physical therapy ball. It's a big ball, isn't it, Bo? And then every now and then we give him a stretch out when he starts getting tight. And he does some swimming up in the Swimming's air, right? a big thing because there's no pressure on his muscles. He can do that. Do you have any financial issues with equipment? Insurance yeah. doesn't pay for everything. So yeah, absolutely. Yeah. We, wouldn't, we wouldn't have a standard if it wouldn't be for another family donating it to us because they yeah. are with the MDA. It means I'll get to see him grow up, get married. Hey, no. <laughs> have children. No. Stop it. And do the things that he has set out to do in life. They they have come very far in the past year or two. So that's where everyone's money's going to, to help him, to help every kid. And we all think there's gonna be a day, there's gonna be something that's going to help them all, that they will all walk.
it only takes that one dollar to, you know, possibly see that breakthrough. Thank you. For providing help for today and hope for tomorrow. tomorrow.